Welcome back people, today we have another unboxing video. So once before I showed my electric pump, but it ended up dying and the uh, the pump ended up giving in after five years, which wasn't bad. Um, it did cost me £20, but I decided to go and buy this one. So this is the Mi Portable Electric Air Compressor, which is the same make as the scooters that I've made videos on, the Xiaomi M365 the M365 Pro and the M365 Pro 2. So yeah, this is the pump and it cost me 40, 40 pounds minus a few pence. So, um, so having a look at it here, have a quick look at the box real quick. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I um, do lots of random unboxing videos and repairs on scooters and electric bikes and all different types of stuff. So it's a 2000 milliamp battery and 150 PSI. So the reason why I like these is because I use them for my bike and my electric scooter and many, many other things. So let's open it up for the first time and we will see what we get inside. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> so I brought my electric scooter close by just so that way I can pump up the back wheel and see what that's like. Make sure it's all good. Let me just, uh, oh wow, look at that. That's uh, a little bit dirty there on the rim. <laughs> right, let's let out some air. I'm gonna make it flat. I think this is the first time this tire's actually been completely flat like that. Never had a punch on it yet, touch wood. Okay, so let's open up the box, okay. Is there? Oh, okay, in there. Now right, let's have a look. All right, that looks. So it's got a warning sign up on the top there. Um, so I'm guessing one of these sides pull out. I'm not sure which side. That side's red, so maybe there. Does that? Oh, okay. Oh, there you go. It turns on automatically as well when you pull that out. Okay, that's um. Not a bad length, I guess. Maybe the length of my palm, where it's a little bit shorter. That's not too bad. Uh, how do I... Oh, okay, there you go. That's how you turn it on. Hit the middle button. Yep, yeah, that's working. There's a little... What's that light there for? I'm not sure. Um, okay, there's a... Is that a light? Oh, there you go. We've got a light on the top as well. <clears throat> Okay, then we press up, that should adjust the, yeah, there you go, that adjusts the PSI. You've got the plus buttons and the minus buttons. Um, how do I change it from PSI to bar then? Maybe this one. There you go. That's bar. Bar and PSI. Oh, it shows you, look, even, look there, basketball. That there looks like, I don't know, don't know. That's definitely a picture of a car. Yeah, that one looks like a basketball. Alright, so let's take it up to 54 PSI, because that's what I want it to be at. So if I plug that back into there, is that going to shut it off? Let's see. Okay, it does. So that's like a safety feature. If I Can I turn it on? Okay, you can't turn it on until there. Where do I... How do I charge this thing? This thing that's it there, yeah, that's it there. Okay, so it's the same port. I don't know if you can see it. It's the same port as um, the PlayStation controller port, which is a micro USB. We've got a few booklets. Well, that one's um, insanely long. <laughs> okay. I'm never interested in booklets, so then we got this little piece here. Okay, that's nice. We got a little bag, so that means I can put um, put the pump in there. That's definitely that would definitely fit in there. That's for sure. Nice and big. I will put it in there after. But first, I want to actually use it. Do we have a charger? Okay, we do. Let's have a look at this. Mm. 
What in the world is that? Oh, oh wow, okay, I didn't let it come with that. Okay, so yeah, micro USB. The um, cable's not very long though. But it'll do the job. And then here we have, what is this? Um, so we've got a valve, which feels like quite a strong valve. Quite thick. That's a valve for balls. And I'm guessing this valve is to uh, put onto the smaller onto the smaller valves by the looks of that <clears throat> because the original valve that it's already on there that is um, that's a car valve so let's put it onto the scooter because that's a car valve as well and we'll turn it on might be a little bit noisy but we'll turn it on and we'll get this pumped up <clears throat> Oh well, wow. it's a little bit, a little bit funny angle to get it. There we go. Oh no, that ain't got it. Okay, let me bring it down this way. <clears throat> it's a little bit tricky this one. Is that screwing on there? It doesn't feel like it is. No, that's not screwing on there. Okay, let me try that this way. Put the camera up a little bit. <clears throat> so if you are able to share the content, please do. That definitely does help me grow as a content creator, and I appreciate everyone who does do that. Okay, so now it's turned off. I'm not sure why. I don't know if that's the... Uh, it could be that the battery's dead. Oh, are you kidding me? Okay, let's unscrew that again. <laughs> no... Doesn't even come charged. Let me take off this little sticker thing there. Oh wow, that's really difficult to pull out of there. <clears throat> yeah, the only one thing that I have noticed is there is nowhere to show low battery or how much battery percentage. So don't like that, unfortunately. It's a bit like my other pump didn't show it. Okay, let's. See what happens. <clears throat> Definitely not as loud as my other one, but that's good. Yep, the battery's a little bit on the low side. That's it. <laughs> it's dead. Okay. All right, so that would do for now. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to quickly just grab my extension. We'll plug it in and um, we'll see if we can see what it looks like um, whilst it's charging. Okay. Let me... I'm going to pull up my extension lead real quick. Trying to do this one hand is not... It's not easy. <sighs> okay. So here's our extension. I've got a USB plug there. Of course you could use a PC. Okay, let's open up the bottom there. Put the cable in. There we go, ended up putting the light on by mistake. Okay, let's push that back in there. Okay, so it's, uh, it's charging. The light's flashing on and off. I'm not sure what colour it turns when it's fully charged. I don't know if it's going to go green or go red or stay white. I'm not sure. Only time will tell. But um, yeah, that 
pump does work pretty quick works quite well i definitely recommend xiaomi as a brand just because i've had quite a few of their scooters and they've never let me down they've been really good and um i like electric pumps for when i'm outside for the motorbikes the bikes the electric scooters and all kind of other different stuff footballs and stuff as well they're good for and um quite quite nice that they add the uh, different valves as well i really like that and of course the lock-in safety uh, mechanism for pulling that out that's pretty cool as well so yeah that's the um me portable electric air pump xiaomi pump i bought this on amazon you can buy them on ebay or amazon and this one did cost me 40 pounds so i hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did don't forget to share like comment let me know if you've got a pump yourself or if you're thinking of buying one but that feels kind of nice as well and it's quite big so i could definitely fit the pump in there and then after i can pull my little strings tight nice little carrying case to stop it getting all scratched up so that's the me electric pump we catch you well i hope you enjoyed it <laughs> we catch you people again soon with some more fun and games i am out